How's it going guys and welcome to the mini toy love channel. Today I am really excited to be opening some Jurassic World toys. I have the awesome Battle Damage Mini Dino Multi-Pack. You get 15 dinosaurs inside. It is such a good value. I found it at Walmart. If you're a dinosaur fan, I highly recommend it and I haven't even opened it yet. <laughs> and then I also have the cool uh, Owen action figure with Baby Blue. Can we just, if you watch my toy hunts, you, you, you know how I feel. <laughs> okay, so lots of cool dinos. Let's go ahead and get started. First up, let's start with our cool action figure pack. Um, Baby Blue looks adorable. You have the exploding volcano, which is not cool. And then the back just kind of has some other figure sets. I'm glad he still has the vest. Owen Grady and Baby Blue, so cute. Okay, so pretty cool action figure, kind of basic design. He is jointed at the wrists and knees, and pretty true to what the character looks like. He comes with a little knife, um, which I believe he can hold. I like the detail, it has his watch too. Oh, get in there. Okay, so there we go. He has his knife, and then he also has a satchel. So, ah, there's that. And then you have Baby Blue. And how cute. Oh, look at the claws. <laughs> the signature Velociraptor claw down there. It's so adorable. I've always loved the Velociraptors. I'm not sure if he can stand, but that's okay. Put the knife down. Um, Owen can hold him. And that's even cuter. <laughs> I can't watch the movie of dinosaurs die, though, guys. I just can't. Okay. He'll actually stand like that holding baby blue so that's adorable that's how I'm probably gonna display it so next up let's open our mini dino multi-pack on the back I believe it shows you the 15 that you get which is awesome because it looks like you get like the whole set along the dotted line you can actually seal it back up and store your dinos inside and I know they also sell like the little mini blind bags but again, this one is a good value. Oops, I did not cut it far Next enough. Up, it comes with this little kind of postcard looking thing to remind you that the island where the dinosaurs are is exploding. And then it also comes with a checklist with all their names. So I will try to pronounce them correctly. First up, we have the Conotaurus. And they don't have much paint detailing on it, but in a way you can kind of customize them and add some more coloration and stuff but the molding is, is pretty cool. So he's always a fun one with those horns. Ooh, he stands. And then we have this cute herbivore big guy. This is an Apatosaurus. And I guess this is the battle, battle damage pack. So they have some, some wounds <laughs> on them, but he's pretty cool. We have another favorite little herbivore, is not so little though, is Triceratops. And it's hard to tell, but they have a nice detailing, just, you know, it's one paint color, but still, like I said, you could customize because they did a really good job on like the skin going on with the Triceratops. That's cool. And then we have another cool one, the Dilophosaurus with its little spitting fans up. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that both of these harken back to the first uh, Jurassic Park. So cool. He was scary though. Another classic is the Stegosaurus with some battle damage. They did a cool job with all the the plates. Spiky tail. Cute little face. His mouth is open there. <laughs> This guy I'm going to have trouble pronouncing, but I think it's his name is Stigmialoc, and his nickname is Stiggy on the checklist, which that's that's fine. I will call him Stiggy. He has very like um, spread out duck feet almost, and it looks like he has one of those crests. Cool. So, I like Stiggy. Then we have this guy. He's a Baryonyx. Pretty cool. He has such a, an alligator type snout. Awesome. I like how all of these do, do stand. 
Um, we have this guy. Let me see. Um, he almost looks like like a mini T-Rex with those small little arms. On the checklist, he's this one. So let's try to pronounce that. Mitria Canthosaurus. Mm. <laughs> yeah, some battle damage. He's pretty cool. And we have some terror from above with the Pteranodon. Yikes, they were um, they were pretty brutal in the first Jurassic World movie. So there they are. I wonder if he'll stand. I don't think so, but he'll he'll lay down and back. And then we also have this guy. He's really cool. Has some battle damage. Looking pretty fierce. He's he's an Allosaurus. Okay, so we have five more. I'm saving some of my favorites for last. This guy is new. So he's called the Endoraptor, which I think is going to be some sort of interesting creation for this movie. He looks jet black with these fluorescent yellow stripes and pretty spooky. They have a larger toy of him and he looks pretty big too. And look at him slinking around on all fours. But yet, um, I seen the big toy and he's standing on both feet. So it'll be interesting to see how he plays out. But then again, I might not see the movie until I read spoilers. <laughs> okay. This next one's really cool. It's the Indominus Rex, but it's clear. So is it like uh, the ghost Indominus Rex? I don't know. I find it really interesting. Does it factor into the movie like this? Or did they just make it because it's cool? But it, neat, neat concept. Maybe he's like a hologram or something. I don't know. But just a, a cool looking clear dinosaur figure. Then we have the Mosasaurus. And it's huge. Or she is huge. <laughs> and awesome. And what's really cool is that the mouth opens. So you can eat things. Dinosaurs and other things. So how neat is that? For, oh wow, you can open the mouth rather far. So that's awesome. That was uh, an interesting one from the first movie as well. Um, quite, quite the surprise at times. Oopsies. Sorry for hitting the camera. And then we're down to the final two, which are my two favorites. First up, we have the queen herself, the T-Rex. And... Just saying she better get off the island because I love the T-Rex. It is the original one from Jurassic Park. I like how they incorporated that in Jurassic World. Nice touch. She is the queen and you better not mess. <laughs> and then last up, we have Velociraptor Blue. And they did a good job with her too. She has the blue streak. Looking very fierce. I love the claws. <sighs> and let's unite her with little baby blue. Oh my goodness. How cute are they together? <laughs> That's awesome. So again, a really cool pack. You get so many fun dinosaurs and if you want to customize them, that should be easy enough to do. <sighs> awesome. Here's another look at all our cool Jurassic World toys we opened today. Do let me know which was your favorite dinosaur in the comment section below, or let me know what you're looking forward to with the new Jurassic World movie. I'm a little anxious, but I still am hoping things go well with an island that's blowing up. <laughs> oh. So there you have it. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you're interested in seeing more, feel free to subscribe to my channel as I post a new video each and every day. I want to thank you guys so, so much for watching. I appreciate it. And I will see you guys next time. Bye-bye.